Hello and welcome to MG Tracy. As you may know, our channel is very keen on the British part works, the magazines that build up sort of fortnight by fortnightly. Uh, one of the current ones that's running is a really different, interesting idea, and that is military watches. 75 years of precision in times of war and peace. So we're on to issue three. And... Uh, this is uh, a UK GB 1970s watch. You can see the, the back there. Telling you about the this particular watch. British Royal Navy 1970s yeah. watch. This striking blue faced watch is inspired by the timepiece issued to SBS Special Boat Squadron Commandos in the 1970s. And it also shows you other watches that are going to be in the collection. You see you've got Russian military coming in a couple of weeks time inside issue 4. So let's have a look and see what's inside the magazine issue 3. Okay let's have a wander through issue 3 then. All info on the front there about the British SBS commando. It's a binder there. You subscribe, there's all sorts of extra bits and pieces. So it's on a, a blue sort of canvasy strap there. Naval webbing strap. Waterproof to 200 metres. Ridged bezel. And this is showing you what the guys were getting up to in SPS. There's more here on tempting you to subscribe. So there's a box there to collect the things in. Uh, what's that? The binders and uh, an extra watch, which is saying it's worth over £50. All part works are very keen to get your direct debit underway. I did have uh, a message from Carl Scholes a few weeks ago. And he said, I subscribed a few days ago and I was sent an email explaining my monthly direct debit for this collection goes until 2017 and that there are 80 watches to collect. Just thought I might point this out. People who don't realise that this is about an £800 total investment. So uh, thanks to Carl there. If anybody else has subscribed and let me know how you're going in the messages below. More bump here about uh, watches generally. Show you when the next one's out. This one about reserving a copy at the news agents. It's a great post on that, isn't it? Look, 12 and 6 for H. Samuel's War Watch. And then what's coming up in the next issue? Watchmakers of the World, the history of watchmaking action stations and then that rather splendid looking i might get that one russian military 1980s watch okay so we're up close with issue three's watch here so i'll get that really focused in for you oops sorry agree that is a splendid watch okay i'll put the links below you know if you want to buy this and you're outside the uk um thank you for watching have a look at the other issues we've reviewed if you could like it it really helps us and please subscribe i'd like to have you on board i'll see you next time